Aha! What have you found, Snowy? Wow! This miniature is a true work of art. It's only a few dollars, sir. It's the first time that I've brought it here. It has been tucked away in my attic for quite some time. It's sold, then. It will look terrific on my living room table. A nice purchase, sir. I hope you enjoy it. Please, young boy, take your hands off my property. I want the ship. The price is irrelevant. Maybe for me, but not for its owner. This young man just acquired this ship a couple of minutes ago. Well, perhaps this young gentleman will accept my very generous offer. No. But you haven't heard my offer, Mr... Tintin. And again, no. You don't have anything I desire. All right. Maybe next time I will be more fortunate. Good afternoon, Mr. Tintin. Who is that man? He has suspicious written all over his face. He's called Saccharine. He's been coming to this market for a couple of weeks now to buy antiquities, he says. But none of the other stall owners trust him. He is rich, they say. He bought old Marlin Spike Hall. I've heard he's restoring it. Well, perhaps this lesson has taught him that there are some things that money can't buy. Thanks, and good day to you. And a good day to you too, boy. What was that? Hey, where's the ship? Oh, the man is gone. Too much trouble for a simple miniature ship, I think. Or maybe not. What's this, Snowy? Seems very old, but I don't have a clue what this can be. A map, perhaps? Stop! Stop! I would even say halt! Yes, everybody, don't move. You are under arrest for pickpocketing. For premeditated pickpocketing, I must add. Gentlemen? Tintin! You're obviously not the pickpocket. Not only obvious, but also evident, I must say. Calm yourselves. What's all this about pickpocketing? A criminal who steals pockets all over the city. He's an evil mastermind. Well, I have been robbed, but the thief has stolen a miniature ship. A ship pocket? An organized gang in our city? Calm down. I don't think the theft of my model ship has anything to do with this pickpocket of yours. I have a feeling that we have already met the instigator of this crime. Right, Snowy. Maybe we should pay a visit to Mr. Saccharin in Marlin Spike Hall and gather some clues. Hmm. Marlin Spike Hall is not easy to find. We will let sleeping dogs lie. I don't think I need Snowy for this. Aha! This is the detour. I should see Marlin Spike soon. Good heavens! This place would give a ghost goosebumps. Does anyone really live here? It seems abandoned. Just as I expected, it's locked. I must find another way to get inside. Excellent security. A hole in the wall near the massive iron gate. Let's move fast.
water. Ow! I, I must reach it. Ow! Whew, that was close. Let's continue. I'm very close to the mansion now. This tree trunk looks slippery. Better watch my step. Slow and steady wins the race, as they say. Gosh, I must be more careful next time. This tree trunk looks slippery. Better watch my step. Slow and steady wins the race, as they say. like a good mystery to keep your blood pumping.
Don't be afraid, Snowy. They're only rats. You have to be brave. Let's find a way into this house, Snowy. Look, our way in. Just a short climb and we'll be inside. Yes, you're right.